Hi, everyone. My name is Josh Cranky. Yeah, just like the owner of the Denver Nuggets. But I'm not into basketball or management, and I'm definitely not a billionaire. What I do know is cars, and that's exactly what I talk about on this channel. All right, enough with the intro. Let's get into today's July topic. 24th, 2024, 1716 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time vehicles are an essential part of our lives, facilitating daily transportation to work, school or vacations. However, sometimes engines fail to start, and when this happens, a common cause can be a lack of spark in the distributor. Understanding why this happens is crucial to solving the problem. Below, we explore the top 5 reasons why there may be no spark in your car's distributor. What does a distributor do in a car? Key functions of the distributor 1. Defective crankshaft position sensor. 2. Problems with the ignition module 3. Defective ignition coil 4. Damaged distributor cap 5. Defective ignition switch Before delving into the possible causes, it is important to understand the function of the distributor. This essential component in classic ignition systems controls the output of the ignition coil and distributes the spark to the corresponding cylinders. It works in conjunction with the coil to generate and distribute the high voltage needed to ignite the fuel-air mixture in the engine. Key functions of the distributor Proper configuration and maintenance of the distributor are vital to ensure efficient engine ignition. Its most important functions are high voltage generation, the distributor interrupts the low voltage circuit at precise times to generate high voltage at the coil. Power distribution, it transfers the high voltage from the coil to the appropriate spark plug through the distributor cap and rotor. If your car won't start and you suspect the problem is in the distributor, checking these five points will help you diagnose the fault. 1. Defective crankshaft position sensor. One of the most common reasons for an engine not starting is a faulty crankshaft position sensor. This sensor is crucial as it monitors the rotational speed of the crankshaft and sends this information to the engine control unit, ECU. If the sensor fails, the proper signal will not be sent, and the engine will not be able to synchronize the ignition timing. Check for loose or damaged wires connecting the sensor to the ECU. 2. Problems with the ignition module The ignition module is critical for controlling current flow in the ignition system. This transistor-operated device allows current to flow through the ignition coil. If there are loose, broken or corroded wires, the module will not function properly, preventing the necessary spark. Clean oxidized terminals and replace damaged wires to ensure that the module is in top condition. 3. Defective ignition coil The ignition coil converts battery power into a high-voltage spark. If the engine starts and then shuts off, or if the engine does not start at all, the ignition coil could be failing. This is especially likely if the problem occurs after the engine warms up and shuts down. Let the coil cool and check its operation. If it still doesn't spark, you probably need to replace it. 4. Damage distributor cap The distributor cap is another critical component. If the engine suddenly stops and will not restart, check the condition of the distributor cap. Inspect both the inside and outside for dirt, rust, or corrosion. Make sure the rotor is in good condition and free of cracks. A bad distributor cap can interrupt the flow of spark to the cylinder, causing the engine not to start. 5. Defective ignition switch The ignition switch is a critical part located in the combustion chamber of the engine. If the switch is defective, the proper signal may not be sent to the ignition system. Check the three switch positions, OFF, ACC, and ON. If turning the key to the ON position does not illuminate the dashboard lights, the switch is probably faulty. Replacing it may solve the lack of spark problem. Car ignition coil ignition coils. How to identify when an engine cylinder fails how to tell if the car's computer is damaged symptoms. In conclusion, if you're facing the frustrating issue of no spark at the distributor, understanding the top 5 reasons can help. You diagnose and resolve the problem effectively. From 40 ignition coils to one out spark plugs, each factor plays a crucial role in your vehicle's ignition system. By systematically checking these components, you can save time and money while getting your engine back in optimal running condition. Remember, a little troubleshooting goes a long way in keeping your vehicle reliable. Thank you for watching, and be sure to subscribe for more automotive tips and insights.